Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Mario Golf Advance Tour. We've done it. We've taken the uh, gold trophy in both the Marion course and the Palms course. We have half of the clubs conquered, but now we have to take on the other half, and we're going to start with the Dunes course, or the Desert course, or whatever you want to call it. Let's go ahead and look at these scorecards. For singles match, it looks like we only have to get 12 under par for this course, which is... Definitely a bit more reachable than, uh, you know, 13, but, you know, it's still we still have to aim pretty high. And for the doubles, we have to get 8 under. So the scores are coming down, but, you know, the courses are also getting more difficult, too. So it's going to be a tall order to see if we can, you know, actually conquer this. Also, I'm really curious about something else. I'm going to also look at my singles tourney stats. How many best badges do we have? We have... Oh... Hold on, is there an overall? Yeah, there is. Um, we have 29 best badges for singles. Yeah, we still have a ways to go. But, I mean, I'm sure we'll get them enough to get 90, which, again, is the amount you need for getting everything. Uh, but, yeah, let's uh, go ahead and move on. Uh, we're going to go to the Dunes course, which is kind of the course that's the furthest out of the way. From where we are, because I believe the Lynx is... Well, I guess the Lynx is up here. Okay, now it's... it's I'd say it's probably equivalent. I do like how you have to go under this archway, though. It's kind of cool. So, yeah, let's see what we got going on here. If you want to win at the Dunes, you can't play conservative. You've got to attack even dicey shots. Golf's about excitement. Players from the Marion and Palms clubs don't know what that feels like. Would you like to play around here at the Dunes Club today? Yeah. They made this course easier because people were complaining that it was too hard. If this is easy, I can't imagine how hard it used to be. To me, I think that screams skill issue. <laughs> Just being honest. To attack this course, you got to be able to control your driver. Gotta. Play around and you'll see. Well, I think I'm generally pretty good with driving, so... I think we'll be fine. See how this goes, anyway. Let's hit the dunes. Yo, this music, though. <laughs> if I haven't made it clear, by the way, Matoy Sakuraba really really great composer known for not just you know the music in this game and this series but also um, you know Golden Sun and can't forget about the Tales series like Tales of Symphonia Vesperia Abyss all those other games really really good composer okay um, I'm not sure how do I want to approach this honestly I, mean, I kind of want to do this, but I don't want to bounce too hard. I'll do it. I still have a power shot too, which is nice. Okay, please, don't, please, get a good bounce. That is a perfect bounce. That is, that is the bounce of all bounces right there. What does that even mean? I have no freaking idea, guys. No idea. But we got a birdie. Yo, Secret of Mana? Let's go? Secret of Mana's winning the D Dunes Cup? <laughs> uh, also, KK uh, Slider, I guess, is here, too. And uh, Let's see, anyone, anyone else we know? Ah, Lamb Chan. Also, Riku from Kingdom Hearts. Shoutouts to Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories, a game I am think I'm playing right now for the GBA series. <laughs> Hope it's fun so far. I think it is. I'm pretty sure it will be. But... For context, like I'm starting my playthrough of it tomorrow for GBA's. Um, but this video is going to be likely like 
two weeks after the fact. <laughs> Which I might still be playing it, but I really don't know. Um, okay, so it looks like... See, I'm nervous, because if I don't get it on the green, it's probably going to hit that hill and not roll up there. I'm going to assume it won't do that, so I'm going to give it top spin. Yeah, that's exactly what I was kind of fearing it would do. That's okay, though. We'll, we'll, we'll sink par on this one. and we can, we can even still chip it in, so... I'm not going to... out too much. The greens definitely seem like they're a bit more extreme on this course. The greens are definitely getting tougher. But they should. Honestly, they should. Okay, let's get an eagle on this course. Or this hole. You probably won't, but... <laughs> Damn it, I'm gonna try. Oh, we're definitely not getting it. With the green's all the way over there. Um, I could try. Those cactuses make me nervous. I'm not gonna mess with those. Yeah, I think that was a good call. So I had that. If I hit those cactuses, I probably would have probably hit the ball at OB or something. I don't like that I hit the rough here though. But at least we'll be slowing down a bit. That is a beautiful, beautiful shot. A little disappointed that the super t uh, toss spin didn't do that much, but... That's good enough to get birdie. Okay, par 3. I've, I've been not doing so well with the par 3s, I've noticed. Par 3s definitely seem to be my kryptonite in this playthrough. Oh, come on. That's... You know what? I don't care. <laughs> it's like, that's a straight putt. I should be fine. So, I took advantage. Okay. Yeah, just in general, I am noticing that this uh, course... Definitely getting some length. There's a lot of length in this course. Meaning, the holes themselves are pretty long. Like, this is lengthy, a lengthy shot. And this isn't even a par 5, this is a par 4. And yeah, look at this green. Damn. Ah, oh, damn. Yeah, it was hard to tell that break, because some of those arrows kind of, like, mesh together a little bit. That's okay, though. Full six. See, I'm trying not to use too many of my power shots. Here might be a good one to use, though. Just because it seems like kind of a long hole. that bounce come from? I mean, I was expecting a little bit of a bounce, but not that much of one. Really a good aggressive chip, though. Yeah, so I'm kind of breaking even on the um, memorial score right now, but... Or, well, in my attempt, anyway. I technically should be playing a bit better if I want to get that memorial score, but... 
In my defense, I think I'm playing fine. It's just, again... It's a tough course. Plus, I think whenever I've, like, played this game before, I've always done, like, a practice round on these courses before I did the actual tournament. Something I'm not really doing here. See, I really meant to use backspin here. But, that's perfect. Oh, God, that's really perfect. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there! Oh. That would have been so sweet. But, yeah, I'm not doing the practice rounds. I'm just going straight for the tournaments. But, hey, considering that's what I'm doing, I think I'm doing a good job, at least. Gotta give myself a little bit of credit. Okay, I, I think I gotta also wind. I almost forgot to adjust for that. Perfect. I'm actually doing, I feel like I'm doing actually pretty decent on the par threes here, which is good. Nice change of pace. Okay, and we hear the par five. Nope. <laughs> it was worth a shot to look at at least. Ooh. Shorts. There we go. I could be really aggressive and go for this, or I could try to be smart and get a birdie. I might just try to go for the birdie. My last two holes were so good, so it's like I might as well try to play it safe here. Although I'm not really liking this shot. My positioning for this is not great. That should be perfect. That's that should be just like a very straightforward. <laughs> Come on. See, at least I'm not... Like, at least I'm not keeping an extra power shot. Like, I am still losing that regularly, so... It doesn't feel as cheap. Although I'm sure that some people still don't really... Think I'm playing fair by using that trick, but... I don't know. In my defense, I feel like I'm using it whenever I feel like I'm getting screwed over. Okay, well at least I'm still losing that driver shot, or the power shot. So maybe that's at least some... Some limits of fairness, I guess. I'm sure that some people are still disappointed that I keep resetting like that, but I don't know. I, I only use it when I feel like I'm really getting screwed over. If it's like an input thing, or just, I don't know, stuff like that. I mean, with the way I'm playing, I could just use save states and just cheat my way to the end completely, but I'm not doing that. I'm using the in-game features to cheat, at the very least. <laughs> okay, so we have six under par. I think we're... I mean, as long as we match that for this, for the next um, nine holes, we should be fine. But we'll see what happens. Also, got some really nice wind here. Expecting a bunker there, though. Uh, 
Okay. Kinda hope the wind carries me up here. It does. Oh, perfect. Plus hitting the rough there kinda slowed me down a little bit, which is good. Okay, um... This is gonna bounce. Rough again? I tried. <laughs> I guess when you're on the edge of the rough, you don't need to hit it that hard, but still. I'll take the par on that one. Can't take too many pars, though. That's the thing. What is with me on the par threes for this course? Things just turned a corner or something here. I don't know. Whatever's going on, I like it. Don't get me wrong. Just kind of wish I would have had that luck for the other ones. <laughs> Can't get too greedy though, I guess. Okay, please get a good bounce. Please get a good bounce. That should be a good bounce. That is a lovely bounce. Huzzah! We did it. Four more. Just have to get four more. We still have the par fives too, so. It's looking pretty good. Could finally use this, although we don't have a great place to land. Hopefully, we land not in the bunker. That is not the bunker. I'll take that. Ooh. The thing is, I don't remember if, like, the sandy stuff is, like, OB or not. Okay, no, just the dark sandy stuff. The light sandy stuff, I think, is just way, um, waste area. Okay, down to one power shot. Now let's see if we can get an amazing chip right here. Yeah, get in there. <laughs> Sorry, Slim Bowser kind of came out a little bit right there. Okay, so we just have to get two more birdies, and we're good. I felt that one. When I saw the way the green was sloped, and I saw there was no wind, I'm like, yeah, this is free. <laughs> of course, accuracy would have probably messed that up if I didn't get the accuracy I did, but... It's okay. This might go over the hole a little bit because of the wind. Or not. I'm not liking where this, this is breaking, though, so this could be kind of a tricky putt. Um, no, not that way. Yeah, I had the right idea. Didn't need to break as much, though. That's okay. That's okay. We're still a birdie away. Or two birdies away. And I've been doing good on these. The problem is, is this could be the hardest one to manage, though. Come on, wind and rain. Slow me down. Slow me down. Okay, that's, it's an attempt. It's a birdie putt attempt. <sighs> ah, damn. Now just watch. It's going to come down to the last two holes anyway. I hate when that happens. 
It just adds pressure to me, and I hate pressure. Okay, win. Carry it, carry it, carry it. That did not carry it. <sighs> okay, I better not use that. Love the sound that it makes when it hits the waist area. Nice pin shot there. I will take that. Okay. If I can get the eagle, I'm good, but... Yeah, getting an eagle. About the... <laughs> I am officially out of power shots. And I'm in the semi-rough. Oh, if that went in, that would have been so good. That would have been so freaking good. Now, how's the rest of the uh, people doing? Wow, Secret of Mana dropped hard. Lamchon is doing a little better, though. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. There's not much to say about this. This is kind of a sucky position I'm in. That once again, I have to get the score on the final hole. What's the green look like? Green doesn't look too bad. Got it. Okay, we got it. Hey, that I did it on the last hole, literally, but hey. Progress is progress. Whew! 536. Holy crap. Um, yeah, I'm giving that to you. I'm giving this to you. I'm just going to give all this to you. I don't care. You got, you got, you got it. And I'll do 82 for you. And the rest of that for you. Okay, let's uh, fix the stats a little bit. Um, shot next time. For you, um... I'm just gonna still increase your distance, honestly. Okay. We did it! We're the champs of the dunes. Give us that trophy. Or give me that trophy. Ella technically didn't do anything for this one. <laughs> and we've unlocked the Lynx. Woo! So we get whole 
17 of the Star Dunes course and hole 15. That was some surprising win in the tourney. Beating Azalea for the title is nothing to scoff at. Link's course is tough, but you're the Dunes champ. You'll be alright there. I think I will be too. But, we gotta go get uh, Ella to do the doubles version. So we're gonna do that next. This has been Slim Kirby. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Later, folks.